June 22nd, Kings Park Industrials with the crosswalks. Uh, we're gonna start down at the south end of town. Um, we, we pushed it back to the 22nd because we wanted a representative from Menace Flint, the manufacturer of the crosswalk, to be there for the installation, make sure that everything goes you know, smoothly. The, the crosswalks that you see at the four corners, we're going to be putting at intersections where we have worn out crosswalks. And it, for a couple of reasons. First is the fact that I think that it really it presents the village very well. They are, it, they are durable. And I think that they're more visible as a crosswalk for people to understand where to go. And I know that we're getting close to... Uh, uh, sort of. We have uh, the, the crosswalk that will be put in front of the theater will be uh, a decorative one. What is it? Piano keys and knives It's and paintbrushes, piano keys, um, <coughs> the tragedy and comedy face, uh, a film camera silhouette, and we were going to talk to him about adding some restaurant um, reference. Right. right now he has a reference to dancers. Uh, so we'll have to talk about what we want to do. Do you want me to announce who the... Yeah. Um, I didn't want to steal your... No. Crosswalk yeah, discussion. Right. That, 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 that uh, all yours, all yours. But we had, uh, I think we had about eight submissions, eight or nine submissions, and the Patrick Arts Council narrowed it down to what we were the top three that met the criteria. And the board uh, reviewed them and chose uh, Dave Rogers as the artist, and he lives in Art Space. So just something a little bit decorative and something that kind of sets us apart a little bit. And, uh, yeah. So, but that's starting on the 22nd. Yes, that's starting on the 22nd. We start the south end of the village, um, so that they, you know, get it. That by the time we get into the real thick of things, they will have a process down. That you know, will will Ocean Avenue be, be paid by that point? Because uh, we are improving in we're improving tonight. Wall to the docks. Um, I can find that out tomorrow. That's well, I think they, they has to be a lot of time. Yeah, yeah. Well, we have two weeks. So if we can get those more in between now and then, okay. definitely we should do that. Because South Ocean Avenue um, from Main Street to the base will be repaid, hopefully within the next two weeks. Terry Street will get done about that same time. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to talk to Joe Mark in more specific days. We were holding off a little bit, as you know, so I'll get those. Um, but anyway, they, they, once they get rolled, they should do three or four days. So I think by the 4th of July parade, we should be get that off the So it should be looking pretty good. Um, also, just the uh, the theater walkway. Are they going to do the lighting with that? That's going to come after the. Uh, okay. That's another step altogether. The way I understand it. Okay. There'll be a little cross crosswalk. I think they've been picked up about three or four years ago, didn't you? About four years ago. Yes. And where when you walk into the onto the cross crosswalk, you hit a button and lights flash in the in the, in the, in the pavement. But the ones by Brookhaven Hospital, Smitty? They work yeah. the same way. Basically the same thing, Joe. They're going to have the chaser lights that go across those shoes. Right. You, uh, you activate them. So right. it'll, it'll just make it that much more visible, particularly with the nice design. Yeah, it's going to be nice. Itself. Yeah. 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 Okay. Um, also, um, Oaks Street, I've been talking about that for about six years.